Um, this is Coyote Hollow Road. It's an unpaved road, and I'm glad of that. And this is the road those guys were walking up. And that's my window over there that I was looking out and seeing them that night that these poyos, these undocumented workers, were coming up this road, hopefully to find their way to El Cajon or Fresno and find work. Uh, all these people are sending money back to their wives. They're here to work. Refugees, late summer night. Woke with a start. The dogs barking out by the fence. Yard flooded with light. Grope my way to the window. Out on the road, a dozen quick figures hugging the shadows, bundles slung at their shoulders and water jugs at their hips. You could hear, under the rattle of wind as they passed, the crunch of sneakers on gravel, poyos, illegals who'd managed to slip past the border patrol, its broncos and choppers endlessly circling the canyons and hills between here and Tecate. Out there in the dark, they could have been anyone. Refugees from Rwanda, slaves pushing north. Palestinians, gypsies, Armenians, Jews. The lights of Tijuana, that yellow haze to the west, could have been Melos, Krakow, Kwangai. I watched from the window till they were lost in the shadows. Our motion light turned itself off. The dogs gave a last perfunctory bark and loped back to the house, those dry, rocky hills and the wild sage at the edge of the canyon vanishing too. Then stared out at nothing. No sound anymore but my own breath and the papery click of the wind in the leaves of that parched eucalyptus. A rattle of bones chimes in the doorway. History riffling its pages.